We need to get rid of these dolls tonight so that Jake can sleep. We, however, could not find Jordan. I don't know where Jordan went to. There is proof that I left the dolls. The two dolls. I think that's a great place for him. Oh, wait. What? That is not a cool trick that the campers put that back on our truck. Let's get that. Oh! Out. It's hanging by his chair! What the? How? How? We chucked you guys on. These things were on a tree. How? Should I play a prank on these guys? Should I tell them what I found? Don't let the bed bugs bite. <laughs> what is that? What is that? Okay guys, um, I'm gonna be sleeping out here tonight because I've been hearing weird strange noise at night. It's really creepy and I really feel like somebody's watching me. So I asked mom and dad if I could sleep out in this tent here. They helped me set it up, but first, I don't have anything to sleep in it, so I have to make my bed. Got my bedding ready. This uh, tent feels really safe because like I have a doorway and it's really like concealed. Yeah, and Logan's gonna be in here guarding me and I think I would get a really good night's sleep in here. I'm gonna play on my phone for a while until I get tired and then I'm gonna get a good night's sleep. Jake, why are you coming back to the room? <sighs> because mom and, dad, uh, mom and dad said I could sleep out here. Can I sleep with it in here? Why do you have, I have to sleep wherever I, I'm at? Because it's spooky in there. It's not, it's not that spooky, brother. Come on, please. Fine, go get your stuff. Oh, my. Okay, hey, right there. Okay, thanks. Make sure you zip up the tent after you're done, okay? Hey, Jake. What? What's the real reason why you're sleeping out here? Because I hear sounds at night. Like what? Like people talking. At exactly what time? I don't know. I'm just wake up at some random time at night. I don't know. What does it sound like, a boy or a girl? I can't really tell. It sounds like a boy and a girl. How often does it happen? It's like every night since those dolls came. How come I don't hear it? I don't know. Maybe you're like a deep sleeper or... And you, you don't, don't know what time? Hey, what is that? What is that? Oh my. <laughs> Boys? Oh, Dad, was that you? What are you guys doing? I, we're sleeping out here. Do you know what time it is? Do you guys think this is the answer to what you're being scared of? Yeah, I mean, like, it's only happened in my room so far. You know what? Here, guys, I'm going to go check out your room for you. Okay. Because if anybody's going to find what's going on, I'll go find it. Okay. I'll get you some answers. Sleep good tonight, though, okay? Okay, thank you, Dad. All right, let's go figure out what's going on. Okay, let's figure out what's going on with these boys. Because I don't need them up all night long. Here's my goal. My goal is to try to find out why there would be noises being made in this room. Because Jake and Ty have never complained before. And complaining now is kind of a little out of the ordinary. So I'm gonna open up their dresser. Well, they don't really have a dresser. They kind of have uh, those drawers underneath their bed. Uh, I'm gonna open up their closets here, try to figure out if there's some sort of, a, maybe a mouse has gotten in the house. You remember when those trolls were here? No, the gnomes, the gnomes came. I don't know if we'd have gnomes because I thought we got rid of every single one, but they could possibly be hearing stuff like that. They also could be hearing, uh, you know, there's there's a street lamp that's not too far away from their bedroom uh, window here. It actually has a lot of light that comes in. You can see just a little bit right above there. That's from the street lamp. And it does go on and off at times. I think it's on some sort of a motion sensor. And then there are, kids in this neighborhood who kind of think they're funny and they go up and down the street making loud noises uh, in their cars typical teenagers and maybe they heard something like that but let's first look in this drawer and see if we can find anything so we got jake swimming wait a second this is what he's hearing you hear that 
That's what he's hearing under his bed. Jake. All right, is there anything else that would be in here? I don't see like any teeth marks or anything that would have scratched it or clawed it or anything like that. These sometimes will creak a little bit because they, they move. So I didn't nail them all the way down. You can see it kind of moves a little bit. Sometimes they will move, but I don't know if that would make it. Let's see if you can hear something. Like that, that could be a noise that he heard. I don't know what else would be in here. Wait. Here's another one of those noise makers. These are like those little sound maker things. Listen to this one. Okay. What I'm gonna think it is, is it's kids outside. I'm gonna think it's maybe this this wood moving a little bit. You can kind of see it move there. I need to fix a couple of spots. Uh, definitely, it's these toys here. Um, oh, there's another one right here. <laughs> right here. Right here. That's what he's hearing. Okay, listen to this. All right, so if I take it, I get them all going. I figured it out. That didn't take a genius. That didn't take a rocket scientist to figure it out. I think that's what it was. House, kids outside, and the toys. Because those toys will randomly start playing. I don't know why. I don't know if they're motion sensor or it will. I'm not sure, but I think I figured it out. The other thing is here, I just want to make sure, is should I play a prank on these guys? Should I tell them what I found? Or should I strategically hide them plus some other ones because they've got some more and really get these guys spooked out. I could actually even put in maybe some different lights, lighting effects where I can do a remote control. Like we have this rope lighting and it's got a remote control. I could do that. I could really freak them out if I wanted to. Should I do that? I don't know. Is it too soon? Should I get them to settle down a little bit more before I do that? And then when their guard is off, then I get them. Maybe I'll do something like that. I'm not sure, but one last sweep. Let's make sure nothing down there. I, I think the last year when the gnomes came, they built something right here and they put all the chairs in the kids' room. I'm going to rule out it's the gnomes. It's not them either. Jake Ty, nice try. I think what they really wanted to do, I think they're crying wolf. So if you don't know about the story about the boy who cried wolf, go check that out. Go Google it. It's out there. I think they're crying wolf because they want to go sleep in the tent. Because sleeping in the tent in the living room is kind of a fun thing to do. I mean, it's, it's a little bit of a, a new... Uh, uh, atmosphere and it's different and I think they just wanted to goof off in the living room. That's my vote. They're goofing off in the living room. They planted the toys so they could say that they were scared but they really wanted to sleep in the tent. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. Jake, Ty, open up. Open it. Open. Yeah. Is Logan still in here? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, let me show you guys what I found. This is what I thought it might be. All right guys, when I went in the bedroom, I thought it could be a couple of different things. I, I thought it could be like mice or rats. Yeah, so I pulled open your drawer underneath your bed and I was looking in there. I didn't find any chew marks. I didn't find any scratch marks. Mm -hmm. So then I thought it could be the gnomes. Remember when the gnomes came last year? Oh. True. And the gnomes were here and they built like their little home in your bedroom first. I thought it could be the gnomes. I searched and didn't find any evidence of the gnomes. But I did find what you were having problems that was making noises. You want to know what it is? What? I found these toys here. So I don't know who. Does this sound right? Does this sound like the noises you were hearing? These aren't the guy. The, the knocking, so. the bong. Could it have been these? Maybe. I don't know. I think so. so. These are mine. I know they're yours. These are all over in your room. How would they turn off? So here's my question is who put them in your room in the different spots and put them on the yeah, motion activation spot? They're in a closet. Nope. It was all over in your room. What? And they were set to motion. So anytime that there's a noise or a sound or something, they make sounds. See? So okay. So I figured it out. This is what was making the sound. No big deal. If you guys just wanted to play and have sure? a fun night then that's fine we can do that tonight's the night you can sleep out here but tomorrow you gotta go back to your own beds all right do I have to go back are you sure it is and it's past midnight so you gotta go to your bed so i'm gonna turn this off turn off all the lights it's bedtime okay okay so let's open or closed well was... okay good night sleep tight don't let the bed bugs bite <laughs> Jake, 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 it's too hot. I'm gonna sleep on the floor in mom and dad's room. <laughs>